Governor Johnson, you wanted to see me? Haley Jones, just the girl I wanted to see. You're an overly ambitious single 20-something that has no life outside of work, right? Uh, well, technically, yes. I don't know what that has it to do means with- It means that you don't have plans for Christmas and I can ask you to work without feeling guilty. Also, so the audience can know you're single and ready to mingle down the line in the movie. Well, actually, I was going to- uh, No need to thank me. No need to thank me. Here's what I need from you, Haley. There's a small town just outside of Metropolitan City called Small Townville. I'm sure you've never heard of it. Every year come Christmas time, their mayor runs their government in a deficit. I need you to go down there and meet with him and find ways we can cut back spending. I expect a full report on my desk by Monday morning. Oh, and while you're down there, don't get caught up in the true meaning of Christmas. This is serious work. Oh my gosh, this place is a dump. Hi, I'm looking for Mayor Robinson. You got him. Excuse the mess around here. We've been trying to renovate the building for a while now. Your Mayor Robinson? What, expecting someone older, a little less charming? Try more qualified. Well, when you grow up in this small town and go to college and graduate first in your class at law school, only to have both your parents die a short time after graduation, it certainly changes your perspective. Didn't have too much trouble beating out the people you guys over at Metropolitan City sent to run against me, though. Oh my gosh, Mayor, I had no idea. I'll be brief. The reason I'm here, my name's Haley Jones. I'm over from Governor Johnson's office. Whoa, Haley, talking business so soon? Aren't you gonna buy me dinner first? I tell you what, I'd be happy to talk about whatever Governor Johnson has on the agenda tonight at seven o'clock over at Tom's Burger Barn, all right? See you there. Wow, Brian, we're on a first name basis and connecting so well. I think it's obvious that I'm falling in love with you, but nonetheless, work must take priority. In the report that I'm sending Governor Johnson, I'm recommending that you cut the family Christmas program. It's costing your local government upwards of $10,000. Really? $10,000, Jones? That's what y'all are so upset about? I've read the archives. $10,000 is Governor Johnson's coffee budget. Tell you what, go ahead and put this in your report. What you folks at Metropolitan City don't realize, this is a farming town. And ever since good old Governor Johnson cut the agricultural subsidies, every family here is barely scraping by. So if I have to spend a little extra to make sure that these kids get Christmas, I'm gonna do it. And if Governor Johnson has a problem with that, he can come tell me to my face. I've gotta be up early tomorrow to deliver presents, Haley. Have a Merry Christmas. Nathan, don't tell your mom I got you that, Need right? me help, Mayor? Jones, what took you so long? Sorry I'm late. I was making a couple of final changes to my reports, like how the family Christmas program here in Small Townville needs to stay, and how Governor Johnson needs to re-implement all agricultural subsidies for these families going forward. Haley, that means so much. Thank you, truly. I tell you what, we could really use someone like you on staff for Small Townville's government. Why don't you stick around for a while? 